So typically the public areas that are not in use are kept under CCTV surveillance um, and by periodic police, security, and airport operations, foot patrols. Uh, the airlines are required to restrict access to their computer systems, so typically shutting them down and having them password protected is considered adequate. The same thing with the screening technology. Uh, specifically though, protection of the computers is the airline's responsibility and protection of the screening equipment is TSA's responsibility. They may enlist the airport's assistance for practical reasons, however. Uh, the primary area that must be protected is what is known as the sterile area. Uh, this is the area beyond the screening checkpoint, all the way out to the passenger boarding uh, bridges or locations. When those areas are shut down at night, um, most airports uh, simply pull down gates to secure them. Uh, if that's not an option, then the sterile area must be searched uh, prior to reopening the next day. Uh, it's a little unusual the the screening equipment is in front of the gates at Apple, Appleton, um, but that may have been done for design reasons or the airport's reference uh, to accommodating late flights. There's additional FAA regulations related to the airport providing accommodations to uh, late arrival passengers that might have something to do with, with the, the uh, situation here. Uh, before the equipment can be used the next day, TSA must test and calibrate to ensure it's working properly. So while it might be subject to vandalism or breakage, it's less likely it can be tampered with in a way that would directly affect its capability uh, without outright breaking it. Uh, there's always a potential for some sort of cyber attack into that technology, and that's an area of security that is so new, many industries are still trying to figure out all of the different ways to, uh, that the system can be attacked so it can also be um, protected. Uh, in all likelihood, uh, in all likelihood, your personal uh, personnel sorry, uh, were observed going through the public areas by CCTV camera, uh, but since they were not tampering with anything, an officer was not dispatched. I imagine if you've caused some uh, interesting conversations prompting the airport and TSA to discuss whether the existing measures over these technologies in these areas are adequate. Uh, so if nothing else, what this has done is, is demonstrated uh, potential vulnerabilities, at least to be assessed to determine if those are real vulnerabilities or to, uh, to determine that they're not.